Welcome back, everyone. This is, uh, me. You know, Michael. Yes, that's my name. Don't wear it out. Um, we are about to set sail. But not actually. I guess we're gonna set rail. Yes, rail. We're gonna go on this massive, huge, um, train, I guess. It's called the Triple Decker Tank Engine. And of course, it's like a kids only, right? See, kids only happy train departing for fun. Yay! We're all gonna go have fun. And of course, they have the clown there, because all kids love clowns, right? And we're just gonna have fun on this train. That's, you know, that's all there is to it. Things, free, you get free things, free good stuff in life all the time. So, oh, this doesn't look quite as fun. Hmm, I'm thinking they kind of tricked us. I don't know. They've got, uh, fun for all. Fun Earl? Earl? Oh no. Oh no! Okay, so this is actually a pretty menacing looking train, triple decker tank engine. When, when, when were tanks ever fun? Tanks were never fun. Tanks kill people. They kill the landscapes. They kill everything. I mean, with tanks you're shooting depleted uranium rounds and you're just like destroying the farmland and and people for generations to come. It's, pr it's pretty disgusting. Something windy's going on outside. I don't know. Sorry. Um, look at, look, it's a friggin' flat bed car thingy with huge massive wrought iron f pointy fence and Oh, that stuff looks kind of fancy, but it doesn't look like a fun place for kids. No, sir. Oh, child labor. Okay. It was a trick. It was a trick all along. Oh, God. So foolish. How could we just fall for it? Oh, man. Stupid kids. Kids can't tell a lie, and they can't turn down a good offer, or what they think is a good offer. You know? Like... Because they're like, why would you, why would an adult lie to a kid? It doesn't make sense to them. They think you're telling the truth. Hey, you want to go to Disneyland? Yeah, let's go to Disneyland. And then you go off to Disneyland, but it doesn't turn out to be Disneyland. It's the dentist. And they'll get you every single time. Every time. Ah, uh, so this is one of the, uh, oh, you hate me. He hates us. Rightfully so. Basically, we saved everybody, but then uh, the Baron got so pissed off, you know, or teed off. He's really teed off because we spoiled his plan. So, um, basically, his new plan is to trick all the kids to get on his fancy train, right? And then take them to some offshore child labor oil rig platform. I don't even know what the heck. Um, and since it's international waters, he can't be prosecuted for, uh, for practicing child labor, right? Because if you saw the previous videos, that's what we had those fancy ambassadors. We had to get them all together so that they could be like, you know what? Child labor ain't right. We're gonna get rid of it. And everybody was happy about it. So the Baron's taken some pretty drastic measures. You can see he's got these stupid kids in... And basically these play pens sort of scenarios. Although he's got a vending machine for for bananas, that's always good. So let's let's start it off. Piece of cake, right? It's a, oh, it's a dog feeder. Sorry, my excuse. I didn't know dogs made a habit of. Oh, those aren't bananas. Ah, my silly. They look like bananas because you remember from. The Zeppelin, right? They have the b banana dispenser, so you can get the monkey the banana. I don't know, from afar it looked like bananas. My mistake. Anyways, there we go. You saw what you had to do. We have to get the dog bone, the dog comes over, then we can take over the dog, because the dog's got the keys for some reason to the pen. Ah, yes. And we have freed our one, uh, our massive brother. He's a lot bigger. He's... We're like, we could fit under his hat, and you wouldn't even know. You would not know. Seriously. Family is on board, yes. This is the thing. We rescued everybody. But, 
but... Dun dun dun. Of course, the Baron has got his goons to take everybody, including your mama. And Papa's still missing. We don't even know where the heck he is. So, it's like a great big family reunion on this triple-decker tank engine ride to hell. Icy hell, though. And an offshore icy hell. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I don't even know what to do anymore. I just give up. Let's go home, guys. Let's make some popcorn. Watch some movies. Okay. That, no, I don't give up. I'm persistent, and you guys are too. We know this. So, what we're going to do, we're going to rescue the family. Stop that. Stop the train. Got to stop the train to rescue the family, because if we get to the international waters, then it's all over. Oh, Thad, nice to see you return again, you big whiny baby. And we've got uh, Spice Girl Jane. You remember her from the Zeppelin at the very start? Good to see some of these uh, these unique dolls carry throughout. It's, it makes you feel like they're in it for the long haul. So of course, we freed one of our brothers, and you can see all these suckers. We can't actually free them. <laughs> they're just stuck there forever. There's no gate. There's no gate. You're 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 done. You're screwed. You better, you better get living, used to living with a bunch of newspaper beds. That would suck real hard. Okay. We're gonna go down. Down seems to be the way to go. Because, uh... Obviously, that's, uh, you know, I don't even know what I'm talking about. Oy vey. I am also kind of distracted because there's, uh, well, there's no audio, but the movie 127 Hours is playing in the background. Dude's got his arm stuck in a rock. It's kind of painful. So here, okay, let's get back to the game. Here is one of the, the big goons that the Baron has guarding various, uh family members he you have to get them to leave their post right so that we can we can rescue them and of course each one they seem impenetrable you know unsurpassable but they usually have one weakness and this guy downstairs is like a weakling when it comes to germs and colds and just like his immune system sucks really really sucks so what you can see here is actually there it's another combo combo action going on here they're kind of hinting at it the fireman he squirts water <laughs> who doesn't and um and then you got the other kid who's like ice man from from x-men or whatever you can freeze hans hans allendorf oh i remember you hans you like cats up. <laughs> so we're going to do the combo with them. And forewarning right now, this is the only solution I show in this video. We'll get to see the other three in the next video. But this is a good one. This is my favorite. Well, maybe not. I don't know. But it's pretty, pretty straight up. He runs off like a little sissy in tights. And now it's time to set our brother free. Oh, I love you. Oh, no, I love you. No, I love you. Uh-uh, I love you. Come give me a great big hug, you grizzly man. That's kind of sick. Actually, you're brothers. You guys shouldn't be talking like that. So anyways, that's it for this one. We're going to continue on in the next one, as always. And I will see you, ladies and gentlemen, then. So I hope you have a, uh, a wonderful time until then. One love.